No, Kakakakakakakakala. No. What the hell changed? I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. Hmm. All right, let's see. So I should have done this way earlier, but apparently the was going to try to see if I can get into the Anthem uh, Alpha, but you can't get on the servers, and yeah, I ain't got that kind of time. So I figured I'd hop back to Plan A, and hopefully this won't take long to get into because goodness knows I ain't got time for this either. Well, I do, but it is what it is. So this is the Marvel trading card game. Um, what it up, my good dude Dips? How is it going, fam? Thank you for the host. Wait, I didn't know, wait, were you streaming? Because if I had seen you streaming, I would have rolled over there. But um, anyway, hope you're doing good. How's, how's everything? I've been peeping in on these streams every now and then. Hopefully, and, and let me know if this is too loud because this thing is kind of loud in my ears. Um, come on, come on. At work, exhausted. Ah, I got you. I got you. Busting up the shift row. Um, yeah, no, you've been. I, no man, I don't even. Hopefully your day can go by fast. Did you just get to work or? Cause I know you had a new schedule and all that kind of good this. Um, and you got excuse me, I got still still rolling with a cold, so and I wasn't gonna do this, but I figured let me get something out of the way. I might actually stream something later on tonight just to make myself feel better. But anyway, this is a Marvel trading card game. While I stop staring at these damn world menus, so this came out in ninety shit. Oh, I got the thing right here. Um, buh, 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 buh. Sure this came out in 2006 on the PC. The trading card game itself came out obviously earlier than that. And don't ask me when because I have no idea. Um, wait, it includes five free online booster cards packed in. Well, that, that shit ain't gonna happen. So Konami put this out and. I'm a fan of card games, as a lot of people, as some people might know. So I said, I want to get this. I'm going to try it. And I'm a comic book fan. So what the hell else I'm going to do but try to find, try to play this game that is just like it. So anyway, I have not played this. I've had this, been sitting on this for a good minute or two, actually, for probably weeks. So I'm just hopping in on this. I should have probably did some, like, preliminary stuff. I should have just did this freaking tutorial. But things have been things, and uh, I haven't. So let's sing it together, shall we? And hopefully I'm going to blow through this so I can kind of get in here. Um, but tis, but tis. So let's see. Introductory. Each player starts the match with 50 endurance points at the end of a turn. Either player has zero, if either player has zero, or if your endurance points, endurance points, and I'm up way too late. This is another thing. How and where did you get this? What up, Wolfie? So I got this off of Amazon. Um, and I paid money. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, actually, I found this on Amazon for pretty cheap. Um, <clears throat> and I made um the one thing I found out was I, I just a little side secret because um. I ripped it 
I ripped the DVD think I mean th- th- the CD thinking I was going to get over on it and apparently you can't like use um you can't use virtual clone disc or anything to play it because it's got secure ROM on it. So I'm pretty sure there's a way to crack it. I don't know it. So you may be able to go on uh, Amazon and find a copy relatively cheap. I forgot how much I paid for it. So there you go. That's your answer. And I know I have seen like the D- the DS version of this out there as well. Um, but I don't know how much that is either. And the actual cards are out there too. But again, I may actually have a set of those cards. I don't know if I do or not. So anyway, um, and how you doing, Wolfie? Long time no see. Uh, let's see. The player with the higher endurance total wins. In a tie, the game continues for another turn until one player is the winner. Before the match begins, either of you or the, your opponent will have the opportunity to decide who has the initiative. Great. So we got to roll for initiative. That's this. This is awesome. I don't even have my character. Uh, in this case, you can decide who goes first. Select yes. Da 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 da. Select yes. Go first. Yes. So I'm running through the tutorial right now because again, I have not played this at all, and I can't. I can't get it any bigger than what this is, and there are no other screen. Um, so I don't know how it looks to you guys. Hopefully it's looking all right. And I'm hoping it's not too loud, because it's, it's, even though I got the sound down on my end, it's, it's a little loud. Anyway, at the end of each turn, the initiative passes from one player to the other. So in this match, you'll have the, the initiative on the first turn. Your opponent will have the initiative on the second. Okay. So that basically means you can you can attack first if you had a can, and then they can attack. Like, okay, fine. Um, at the start of the match, each player is dealt four cards from their deck. Click. Uh, these are the cards in your hand. To see a card, place the cursor on it. It's not letting me do that, except for this one that's already up here. But anyway, details appear on the left side of the screen, use the scroll control to control through the card text. Hmm. So yeah, and I apologize to people because yeah, this might be a little bit boring to people who don't like card games or me for that matter. So I'll just whatever the case may be. Um, and this thing does have a little bit of, come on, come on, there we go. Uh, starting with the player who is going first, both players have the option of either keeping the four cards or exchanging the form. Like, yeah, basically you can mulligan if you don't like your cards. Um, select yes to take a mulligan. I assume it's going to want me. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. There we go. Hmm. Let me know, Wolfie. I could probably hook you up with this if you want it. Um, let's see, actor. Da, 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 da. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that anyway. Just, just say, uh, when you take a mulligan, you can return your original four cards to the bottom of the deck before you dealt new cards. You can choose the order in which they are returned to the deck. Oh, that's what that was about. Okay. Uh, select each card. Do then select done. Hmm. Activate. See, again, this is supposed to be tutorial, tutorial, so I have no idea what I'm doing here. Um, talk of the sunsets while exhausted. Doom turn to the to turn against one attack for each character in your front row. This might actually be a short stream in a short game because goodness knows. Um, I probably should have put some time in on beforehand. So let's do this. Basically, it was strong internal instincts. Sue will fight to her last breath for those she loves. That does make sense. Because I guess I'm assuming this is eight cost. This is attack and this is defense. Um, if it's like any other. What up, Tito? Yeah, I said um, I was going to try to stream sometime today if not today tonight and I probably will do it again tonight if i um if i have the gumption you know what let's just do uh yeah 
done. Alright, Mulligan all those cards got new cards. Uh, these are four types of cards. How's it going, Tito? Uh, there are four types of cards in the Marvel Trading Guard game. Okay, yep. Come on. Click. Character cards. These are the heroes and villains who fight for you. Hmm. Equipment cards. Uh, your characters can be equipped with these cards to gain new abilities or enhance abilities they already possess. Okay, card stuff. Uh, crap. Plot twist cards. Plot twist cards. Plot twists are situations that affect the characters in the game or the state of the game in general. So, let's see. What is this? Is Target defender gets plus five attack this time. Okay, sure. I, I, I get that notion. Good, just doing Christmas. Yeah, I saw <laughs> I saw your tweet a little bit ago um, about being out with your brother. So I hey, I don't envy you the homes. <laughs> Hopefully you you can get out that um get out that traffic quick fast and get everything done. Cause I would hate to be in your position. <clears throat> I hate Christmas shopping. And I hate shopping with other people too, cause ugh, man, people trying to do too much. Anywho, um, but I'm glad you're doing all right. Good to see you, as always. Uh, location cards, locations are places in the Marvel universe, like plot twists. They can affect characters and the state of the game. So, in other words, this base card. Uh, da -da -da -da, whenever you recruit uh, an equipment card, if you control a Fantastic Four character, draw a card. All right, I'm gonna pretend like I actually know. Yeah, right. Don't believe that mess. You know, people put, paying attention to your to your. <laughs> you know, good and damn well the, other, the the people paying attention to your Twitter. Stop all that. Yeah, if I can get away with it, I would I would shop online also. And, and now that I think about it, well, my shopping list is very very small this week this year because I ain't got no money so. That's just gonna be what it is. You got a big game. Y'all let me know when you guys are on. Like my schedule's been really, really stupid lately and I need to be, um, and it, hopefully it will change soon when I find me a job. Um, hopefully it will change soon for the better, but y'all let me know <coughs> when y'all get on it. I'm assuming y'all still doing the Mondays or something. I don't know, but you know, let me know. I might. The only problem is sometimes y'all are up kind of early, and I only get up until like late in the afternoon. Like normally, I wouldn't even be up now except for just I happen, happen to be up already. So Mondays and Fridays, okay. Yeah, so both of y'all can have somebody to whip up on. That's fine. I'll be that. I'll be that. But um, yeah, like I said, just let me know. We want to get on the smash. Ah, yeah, y'all, that's on y'all. I have never, never, I have not liked Smash. And I hear, I don't know, everybody in their grandma of those seems like they're trying to get on Smash. And I'm like, I, I could never get into it. So, y'all have fun with that. <laughs> Let's see, this is a character team affiliation. Same character from the same team affiliation. It doesn't work well together. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, this is, oh, finally. This is recruit cost, so this is the number of resource points you must spend to in order to recruit. Yeah. Hey, you know what? Y'all get on that smash. I'll watch y'all do it. That's that's for sure. But uh, I can't get it on it myself. That's all. Um. So let's see, this is attacking a fan. Got it. Yep, it's a card game. I got you. I got you. Uh, the text box explains the powers and restrictions. The product. The character has the text displayed at the bottom is flavor text, <laughs> a quote, a quote or other non-game info. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how card games work. That's fine. This is good though. This is good. Mario Kart is still my number one game, regardless. Yeah. See, if I could get up early enough, because I've seen your tweets and I was like, if I could, get, if if I was up early enough, I would hop in on you. I would hop in on that. But like I said, you know, you know. With um with my sleep schedule the way it is, oh man, I'm just happy you're happy with it. That's that's the thing about it. So, so I was more than happy to be able to do that for you. 
<laughs> Especially the fact that you're still playing it, you know, because it was like, though it's Mario Kart, who's not, you know, that's a, that's a game people get some mileage out of. So, hey, you know, it's all good, bro. It is all good. Wait, did you get in on um, Splatoon or no? Because I know Dipped is. Um, let's see. While I wait for that, uh, when you recruit uh, an equipment card, you must attach the character plan. Da, 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 da. When this character is equipped, it gains the ability to file just described in the equipment card text. Da, 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 da. So, yeah, so it'll bump your shit up. Gotcha. Uh, that's my favorite. What? Uh, oh, Mario Kart? Or uh, Splatoon? Let's see, the engineering plot twists don't recruit, have a recruit cost instead, they have what is known as a, I have it, but I suck at it. You know what, hey, I ain't great at it either. Like I've gone, like me and uh, Nubian Beauty have gone in there and played a few, have a few dozen matches. And I've actually gotten better at it, um, but I only play like turf. Like I know Dip being out there doing, um, shooters are usually unacceptable. Yeah, I can understand that. Yeah, it's like if you got a disability that that um, that um, give you some problems, you know, cause it with your mobility. Raven, good morning, Raven. Knight. how's it going? Matter of fact, hold on. While I'm doing this, um, where are my manners? I totally forgot to be shouting out people. Let's see, you may be out, but Dip Gaming's, yeah, of course, of course, he's playing Smash. I didn't know that. See, um, I'm had to um. I basically play games with one hand. Hey, I mean, hey, you, you got to do what you what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? Um, so if you can do it at all. That's a good thing. And if the music went out, that's because I'm I just tapped out of the game. So, um, da, 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 da. oh, uh oh, Tito, did I fuck up your? I sure did. I fucked up your um thing. Hold on, do the do the Q eight five. I knew something was fucked up. There we go. Oh, he played it last night. So, okay. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't see him on uh, stream last night, so I'm, I had to go over and check it out. So, anybody out there, y'all check out uh, Tito. He streams every now and then. Dip gaming, he's always always streaming. Sometimes on the late night, a lot of times in the mornings, depending on when he, um, you know, when he can. He's um, he is the the, the the switch ambassador, as I like to call him. <laughs> and shout out to T -ho Tito Q85, who's usually around there modding it up for my dude and, and with the um, with the music. And uh, and of course. He claims he don't stream. He claims he doesn't stream. And you might not catch him stream, but he does catch him stream. That dude is the streaming as Joker. I know. If he ain't streaming himself, he is co-streaming. He's hooking up other people's streams. He is he he don't even he's so good at streaming, he doesn't have to stream. He's in other people's streaming streaming. So you need to go and follow Raven Knock. Right now, not now, but right now. Tell him, Tito, Raven is the best streamer. If he don't come to your streams, you ain't good. You ain't, you, you ain't. So I feel blessed right now that he is, he's, he's, he's coming over to, 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 to check me out. So go follow Raven. He gonna stream some more. If he's not streaming, he's co-streaming with people. Making their streams better. Period. End of story. And speaking of end of stories, let me try to finish this tutorial so I can get into some actual gameplay. <laughs> um, but to answer your question, Raven, yeah, oh, I got thoughts about the Game Awards. I'm like, how in the world did Red Dead just sweep? That was freaking ridiculous. But then again, it was expected, though. It was expected, though, because think about it. If you think about it, like most of the game, I was I was not surprised that God Award. Well, actually, let me phrase that. So, I was surprised. I know for best music, also that was crazy. But see, Red Dead just came out. It was on a bunch of so therefore it was on a bunch of people's plates. So by the time the nominees came out, it was a wrap. 
<laughs> you so stupid, Tito. <laughs> um, so that's all it was, though. It was because, and that's how it happens. That's exactly how it happens. The newer the game, the closest to the awards um, happen, you know it's a lock. Like, and out in the world, the God of War, not, okay. God of War is probably a good game. I, I have it. I haven't played it yet, so which is probably a bad thing on my part. But how in the hell it got game of the year when only certain, like, the only people who could play it is people on PS4. So you mean to tell me the only people that, and I'm not saying that this is not, it couldn't happen, but it's, it seems kind of ridiculous. Like, a I don't care how good people say that God of War game was. If there's no way in the world it could have gotten Game of the Year, Game of the Year. Right, because like most of the stuff that won, well, I ain't gonna say most of the stuff. Like I took notes and I got, and I told myself I was gonna do like a podcast or something on it because it was it was kind of it was kind of silly. But that's what usually ends up happening, especially around Game Awards time. Like the closer the closer uh, the game comes out, and the, the more hyped it is, or as hyped as it is, it's gonna be a lock in, in some in some categories. It's ridiculous. I was kind of surprised Dead Cells won one. I really was surprised about that, you know. And I knew some of the um, a couple of the others was probably gonna get something, but it was like Red Dead for all of those character categories when it just came out. Spider Man won nothing, which was another thing. But again. Again, yeah, um, yeah, that was a whole nother thing. I'm like, I don't even know who that C9 person, but that ninja one was like, you know what? Fuck that. I was happy for, um, I was fuck happy for Sonic Fox though. He got up there and, and, and told it. So <laughs> I'm like, you know why ninja one ninja one. Cause he got, cause he got all the hype cause of, uh, cause of Drake. Um, yeah, sure. He's probably a good. He he's probably you know he was already a you know a, a well known streamer already already but I'm pretty sure that helped that um that um oh yeah you didn't hear about Dauntless yeah Dauntless is going console and going cross platform so I need to get back I need to get back on that um because I don't know I got into Dauntless. A little bit, but um, I got into Dauntless a little bit, but I didn't, but I didn't get into that um that much. So you know, let me get through this. The colors I have. I should just stop doing this tutorial and because I'm sitting here running my damn mouth and not doing the damn games. Uh, <laughs> so that's pretty good though. Uh, like I said, Dauntless. I don't want to say Dauntless is a pretty good Monster Hunter clone, but that's kind of what it is. Speaking of Monster Hunter, because Monster Hunter won for whatever it won. Wait, let me go back and see what they won as. Won for. Um. Oh, best best RPG, which I'm like, okay, I get what they were going for, but those other those other games in the category were more actual RPGs than than um the monster hunter was and like i said i was glad to see it in there but i was kind of surprised that it actually won so but yeah that whole shit with 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 ninja and c9 and fucking red dead that was like fucking ridiculous uh, anywho i don't think of an rpg that's what i'm saying it's not though i mean I mean, it is, but it isn't. Like, you think RPGs, like, you think, like, Final Fantasy. I'm thinking, like, Final Fantasy, like, like half of those other games that was in that category. Like, yeah, if they said MMO or something, yeah. Like, no. Well, I mean, I'm actually surprised because I heard... Like, I'm kind of surprised, um, what, was Final, Fan Final Fantasy 14 was in I can't remember. Like, I don't know. It's, it's almost like they said, you know what? We need to find another category to put uh, Monster Hunter in outside of Game of the Year. And I was kind of shocked that it was nominated for that. Because I think that and... I think those were the only two categories that, that Monster Hunter was in. Like, Game of the Year and that one. So they figured... I don't know. That was, that was totally weird. 
<laughs> I don't know. Sea of Thieves. I know you saw the Atlas one, right? That um that Atlas MMO that um the ARC people are putting out. That seemed like that might be kind of cool. I know. Oh, my bad. Um, shout out to Fate. Who came in the chat? What up, Fate? Um, if I can get my typing back in, let me see. Thanks. If my fingers actually work, this would be great. Shout out to the Panks Nomad who's playing. Oh shit, Mark of the Ninja. Yo, I love Mark of the Ninja. That game is dope. I love that game. I love that game. It looks interesting, but the interest is by the arc. Yeah. Um, I was kind of wondering about that. But I mean, and then I'm kind of wondering. Like, okay. I don't know how big, um, I don't know how big, big the people who make ARC, you know, that camp is, but they got ARC over here and they got this, which is going to take a whole bunch of resources. I don't know if, are they actually going to spend more resources over here on this other game or they got enough to do that since it's not skeleton in terms of it's already a winner. <laughs> nice. So, but, um, I don't know, man. This is it's kind of crazy. So anyway, after the draw phase, the game for season. Of, dun, 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 dun. Let me see if I can run through this real quick. Second phase is the build phase, which consists of three steps, resources. I am going to assume, and I shouldn't do that because this is going to be ridiculous if I do. This is a card game, um, like Magic, like Hearthstone, like any of these other ones. So far, it is. But what I don't want to do, play it as a resource. But what I don't want to do and sit here and act like it is and then I miss something. And that is very much easy to do. Let me see, play as a resource. Can I? There we go. After you play a resource, your recruit step begins. You're ready to recruit your first. Okay, so I, so I put down on a location that has a cost and a resource. And now I can put down a character, which, let's see, Sonic. Hmm. The gold number that shows how many resource points are available is over here. Um, to pay recruit and other resource costs, these points are only... Actually, that's not that. What is that right there? So I'm just going to say, I see them wheel out the big three console giants on set, and I listen to them all smile and talk about them. You know what? That's kind of funny. They're funny you said that because um, they because whichever one of them said something about playing together, I'm like, yeah, but ain't no crossplay. I said the exact same thing to myself, but you weren't expecting that. It was a good gesture that they all got there together in one room. Come on, I I I agree with you about that, but I don't know why you were expecting that. No, I don't I don't even know why you was even expecting that. <laughs> Like, like I'm sure Keely went to get to them and be like, hey, yo, this would be cool if y'all were up, up, up here on stage. Since y'all are all re are going to be here anyway, y'all get up here on stage and, and have a nice little song and dance and we'll see what, we'll, you know, we'll go from there. If they were going to, Ryan Seacus has, not, has no pull. <laughs> <laughs> stop it stop it don't 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 disrespect keely like that by calling him Seacrest. although i can see why you say that but come on he's trying keely's trying um but yeah there was no way like i thought about that for a second and it was like there's no freaking way this is just this was just a a, a a dog and pony show as they say and it kind of and it was so but again it was nice to see them together you know even if there wasn't anything, you know, that was going to happen on those lines. Let's face it. We got many, many a way to go before that ends up happening. Let's see. Select Frankie. So Frankie's one cost. She's a 1-1 one, one for one. Uh, hello? There we go. Double click. Double click. Then we we'll watch together. He is wearing a tux with a tie, not a bow tie, and loafers and not socks. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Well, you know, 
Oh, wait, how old is Ke I don't even know how old is Keezy Keely. It doesn't even even really matter. But I mean, <laughs> he's a gamer, man. He is the gamer. He has he has holding been holding the gown down for games for ever years, ever years. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. Although the weirdest one out of seeing them three together was like Reggie, because I feel like Reggie was about those like I kind of want to bop these two in the head, you know, enforcer style, like just take out my tongue and kakunku. <laughs> but um, it's it's just I don't know that that whole scene was real funny. <laughs> that was whole oh that shit was weird the pepe yeah the pepe the prawn shit and ninja although it was kind of funny though it was like you know what i would rather hear pepe than ninja any day so that part i didn't have a, that much of a problem with that so <laughs> let's take a shelfie <laughs> So, I mean, if they had just let um, Pepe do it by himself, that'd have been that'd have been better with me. So, <laughs> I would like to believe that uh, Miss Piggy would have more sense than that, or be a little bit more selective than that. You know, and hell, Ninja kind of looked like a muppet at that point. But anyway, screw it. Let's talk about let's talk, not talk about that dude. Um, she's hip on the nerds. <laughs> Oh yeah, only if they're frogs. Um, all right, so what are we doing here? Select a position in the front row. There we go. Uh, as long as you have resource points available, you can recruit uh, additional characters. Great. I'm probably not gonna remember half of this shit and I'm too busy. Uh, for now, select past and end the rec recruit strike. And you gotta, oh. I am following the damn tutorial. Stop it. Mind you, this is an old game, so, you know. And I'm old myself. Oh, why did it look like, um, why did it look like, um, Phoenix was naked up in here? Um, I have to wonder how they decide who gets into it. Yeah, I don't know. I wonder, because I know, because he said himself, like, there was, like, so there was, well, he said about the judging part already, but I don't know who gets to pick what goes into the character. He, they, he did kind of fudge when it came to that part. Because it was like, well, here's the people, you know, we got judges and we got the, the fans, but, no, 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 no. But who makes the cut didn't say shit about or who decides to make the cut, which I'm, I'm assuming is probably judges. Which still, still kind of doesn't make much sense. All right, pass. Uh, after recruit strat, the formation step begins. We'll talk more about formation later, but let's move. Pass it in the formation plane. The build phase is now complete. Uh, I mean, if you have to ward that cloud nine, yeah, five years in one, you're doing something wrong. Yeah. So that was the thing that was funny to me because they he did say that it was like, well, we got judges vote. And we got fans vote and he was in that um you know they didn't want to somebody asked them you know why wouldn't they go all fans because obviously there was going to be some you know some um some dirty did some some gaming of the system as it were so i would like to believe and maybe they have this place but i seriously doubt it that maybe hey if you've won this award X amount of times, then you have the option, or you just get straight up out, out of the railing for a year or so. You know that would only make some sense. Because again, in in a in a category like that, like I don't know, you you're right. You're just going by name recognition, and that's it. And technically, that's kind of what awards gonna go by for. Because again, I'm going back to the game of the year. There is no freaking way God of War should have won that. I don't care how good the game was. The only people who played that was on PS4. Which means something wasn't right in the water because they can't that many PS4 player players played it between the judges and the freaking fans to, to make that happen when 
probably half of those other games, but I don't remember what it was, you know, were multi-platform. How does the how does a game that's only on one platform get game of the year? Like granted, if I didn't Spider One, I probably wouldn't have been so mad about it. But you know, that's my bias. Hype. Well, yeah, I mean that is true. But still, that makes no it makes no sense. And granted, I didn't vote, so. I mean, you're right, and that's that's the whole thing about reward award shows. It's always about the hype of the game. But there was hype on a lot of those other games too. And a lot of those other games were multi-platform, which means more people should had the opportunity to play them. That's the part that doesn't make any kind of sense. Well, see, I think it wasn't. I would like to believe it wasn't uh, Red Dead Two because of it was already winning left and right. Like if it, the, if it had gotten Game of the Year, there would have been called somebody would have called foul. I would have called foul personally because it was like there is no way in the world it should have been getting this much. The game just been out a couple of weeks. So anyway, that's. Um, let's see, the opponent appears as bait first. I don't know if you know why I'm even playing for. I'm gonna just sit here and talk to the chat <laughs> for X amount of minutes. And actually, oh shit, what time is it? Yeah. Um, now I'll watch RT, RD2 enter the streams. What the hell does this thing? Yeah, and you know what? All every time, as much as I enjoy a good orchestral music score. I skip past all of them, with the exception of the game of the year one. But you know, um, but I skip past all of them. I did listen to a little bit of the the Red Dead one just for like a second. I was like, okay, dude, whatever. But I skip past all of that. Um, but yeah, I didn't think of there was doesn't much from what I've seen in streams. I didn't think there was a whole lot about the music that wasn't. You know, it was good music. It was time, you know, it was, you know, reminiscent of the time, but it wasn't that great. Wait, this is a Kristoff. Oh, okay. So what am I doing here? Uh, when you choose to attack, you must attack the Kromos characters, if any, before you can directly attack. So you, we got a lot of points. Um, I was reading Twitter posts during the awards, and this guy is defending Red Dead wins by saying it deserves. Fuck that. That's a bullshit. No. First of all, it's an open world game, which, you know, and what a, the, it ain't no damn linear story bullshit. Now, all right, sure. I'm sure you could play it in a linear fashion, but no. Oh, but it's me, uh, saying that it deserves for best story because it's a non-linear game. And I'm like, what? I mean, that still doesn't make I, I, re, I misread that the first time that still doesn't make any kind of damn sense just be, it doesn't deserve a best story if if it's a best story has nothing to do with how linear it is i mean it's how the, the, the fact that it's non-linear the story is point a beats 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 point a point b finish the story there is that is it in itself is linear so that person's on drugs <clears throat> Well, see, yeah, I don't know anything about the character creator because I haven't, I haven't messed with it. But if it's just like um, GTA's, I'm, I mean, uh, yeah, GTA's, I'm probably not surprised by that. Which, which reminds me, I hadn't played GTA in since I bought the damn thing. Um, the offline is linear. The online is interacting with other, right? Basically. So, I don't know. Yeah, I don't. From what I've seen of the character creator, I'm like, oh, okay, it is what it is, you know. You could do things with it, but you can't get crazy with it. So, I still think, although I do remember seeing um, something from the online, I really kind of wish that you could, um, <laughs> that on the, the online person, not that I would care because I probably wouldn't play it that much anyway, but... If it was like a version of Lamar from GTA Five that was that was um, meeting you or something, that would have been kind of funny. But that's just me. So I don't know, man. Reward, award shows, you get, you know, you expect a certain kind of um, 
hype and junk out of award shows. That one, uh, you know, they pulled it off. There, you know, you saw some, ex- not necessarily excuses, but you saw some new games out of it. And that's kind of the more I went into it for, as opposed to the wars themselves. And that part was kind of decent. Uh, select uh, Kristoff as your attack. Oh, that was easy. Okay. After you propose an attack, the attack proposal decide to change. I'm seeing it like I said, running my mouth and not doing the damn game. Um, holding down a chain control, you can look at any events associated with the chain to get more in- on that event. Uh, the initial chain view shows the card that initiated the current chain events. Uh, you can see more of that. So, okay. When you place the cursor over a chain icon, I don't see a chain icon. Um, so some of those I had so so I was in the middle of podcasting when the awards show came on. So I so when I got off of so when I finished podcasting, um, I saw one I'd already been spoiled on Game of the Year. Two, I'd already seen some of the um, some of the reveals, so I'm like, well, Rage Two, that was a known that was a known issue, um, and I saw something about the Crash Team Racing, and I'm sitting here like, really? Why are they bringing that back out there? And the Atlas one, I kind of heard 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 something about too, but, uh, like right after it. So I was like, well, let me go see what this, you know, I can still go see what it's about. Um. Let's see. So I was not happened with the cinematics, but let's see. Here's the thing, though, uh, with the cinematics um, that showed it in the gameplay. But, but that's just it. <laughs> because it's fun. You know what? But you know what? It's, hold on, hold on. So, fate. Um, you have a switch. You have you played Mario Kart? There's this game called Mario Kart. Okay, that's what I thought. Good. So. Um, let me introduce you to another game you may or may not have played that is actually also pretty good in that style. Sonic and All-Stars tra- Racing Transform. That, if you want to do a good knockoff, um, if you want to see a good knockoff Mario Kart, that is a good one. In fact, if anybody's got it on PC, I would love to play that with you. But anyway, I, again... Like I said, I'm not going to see here in fanboy over Mario Kart, but let's face it, it, it is good. <laughs> it is a good one. It is a good and it's great. Crash Team Racing was not that great. I'm a, I'm going to have to fight you on that one. I, I remember playing CTR. I mean, I would rather play that Sonic fight em, That was, <laughs> I would rather play that Sonic one over, over Crash Team Racing. Now, maybe this new one might be some good. But from what I remember, the original CTR, it wasn't that, good, that great, especially at the time. So, I mean, Mario Kart, as much as I hate to say it, Mario Kart. Now, I will give Nintendo shit for shit, for a lot of shit. Mario Kart, Kart is a good game, and the comparisons of whatever, whatever, whatever it is, what it is. But it is functionally a great game. I, I can't even front on that. Hold down the, wait a minute, hold down the chain control to see. Okay, well... Right. At this point, you can play cards, powers, and effects you have available. So, again, like I said, this new one might prove me wrong. I still say it goes Mario Kart, Sonic, uh, Sonic and All Stars Racing Transformed. Yeah. Mario Kart again. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> okay. Word. <laughs> okay, Twisted Metal. Oh, speaking of, have y'all heard that um, THQ's got Carmageddon, the Carmageddon license? So we're getting, a, uh, we're potentially getting another Carmageddon. Speaking of Twisted Metal. Um, okay, Twisted Metal. <laughs> Although I ain't gonna lie, I did like Twisted Metal too, but car combat games. I don't. I can't even imagine a car count but game right now being coming out and being worth anything. I don't like car combat games have had its time. Like I'm kind of surprised car games kind of are sort of sort of here. But then again, it's Mario Kart, so car, Mario Kart's got um 
nostalgia attached to it. So I want another. Yes, yes, Fate. I know, I know. We all know you want a, another Mercs game. Oh, they did. Oh yeah, there was also um. Although to keep teasing this, I'm. You know what? I wasn't surprised. That I was kind of surprised that didn't um. That it didn't play any of, or they didn't have anything on. Um. Uh, Kingdoms Hearts 3, because I know Twitch has been streaming Pokemon, and all I've seen within the breaks are fucking Kingdom Hearts 3 stream, um, commercials. Lord knows that game ain't coming out. But anyway, okay. Oh, wait, what are we doing? Okay, this got tapped. He's doing this. Can I do something? Target Defender gets plus 5 attack. This time. For now, however, let's just pass and let the attack play. All right, fine. All right, so they both tapped. I'm actually, <laughs> nope, it ain't coming out. When January whatsoever it is gets out, gets out, and I see you streaming it, or or D or whoever else. Um, I don't know who else. I know there was a couple of y'all that I know that that are like a, or newbie or somebody. Whoever else is, gets it in their hands and stream it, I will believe it. Until then, as vaporware. I don't stream the Disney's machine. You know what? And that's fair. That's fair. What you got against Disney, man? I mean, you see this fine Marvel product right here, which granted was was done by Konami, by the way, not Disney. Um, oh, speaking of, that was speaking of the Game Awards. Um, and I saw this before I saw the awards. Anyway, Marvel Ultimate Alliance three, although it's going to be a Switch exclusive, probably a timed exclusive. I'm assuming. That is going to be a timed exclusive because I can't imagine. Although, I mean, the Switch has been picking up some stuff. I would hope that is going to be a timed exclusive because I would really, really hate. Yeah, I know. Although, so timed exclusive means that they will have. Like, it's going to be exclusive on the Switch for a certain amount of time. Like, say, six months, a year. There have been other games in the past that have done that. And um, I can't think of any. There are some that I can't think of uh, right now. Like, I think Sunset Overdrive was probably one. Actually, no, because that never came to it. Because it just came to PC, not just that. But basically, there have been some... Okay, PUBG had a year time exclusive deal. Yeah. So there have been games that have done that. So they'll say, like, they'll come out and they'll be like, exclusive, but then you'll happen to see it come out on other platforms later on. Yeah, PS4 just got just got PUBG uh, on the the, um, the Game Awards. So yeah, that's, bas that's basically that. <clears throat> and there's been other games in the past that have done that. And like I said, I can't think of any, like, high profile ones that have, that have done that. Um, so I don't know, like I can, let's put it this way. Um, Marvel Ultimate Alliance three, I'm happy that it's coming out. So I'm happy that, it's, so for that respect, I'm happy and I hope it does well on the switch and I may or may not get it. I, I feel like I probably will. But at the same time, I'm like, I don't want it to be just exclusive on the Switch. Like, I would rather, like, say, well, like, Bayonetta. I figured, I thought Bayonetta was going to be a, a timed exclusive, but that's, apparently that's not panning out to be this. But then again, you know, a time and a place and a thing and a way. Um, Frank Away's Attack is 1, which is equal to Chris off defense and the stunned. The fact of stunned is also compared to. I'm gonna wait to see if it comes out on Xbox. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of wanting to wait and see if it comes out on PS4. And um, like I said, I have nothing. So I know if Dips is still around, he's gonna hate me for this. I don't think a whole lot. There is not a whole lot of games. I'm happy to switch is getting games. Period. I don't think everything they're pointing over to it should be on the Switch. Period. Like and I, and I know fate you you want Diablo on, on the Switch. I don't see why why would you play it there. I don't see why anybody would play it outside of the PC personally. But that's just me. That's just me. Like it, it runs fine on the consoles, but there are certain games that's like 
the switch is not going to be a good like it's gonna they're gonna get it to run and from what things they've gotten to run on it is a miracle but it's more to make more it's to make more money eh I don't know again like I said I would look eh, I would be too but see here's the thing perfect example Warframe new one on phone get with <laughs> okay first of all you bite your damn tongue Raven uh, Diablo 3 is still hot in the streets and don't let um and, and, and don't let Nico uh, hear you say that because she fights you. Um, and if she don't, I probably will. But anyway, but no. Like I said, Diablo 3 has always been a PC game to me. It runs fine on console. And actually, I'm, I'm happy that they got it running the way the nicely on console the, the, the way it is. So that's probably a bad example. I, from what I've played with, for Warframe, I'm liking it too. Um... There's a weird thing about certain games that have that that have come out on PC that are specifically PC ver like say MMOs let's say that get ported over to consoles that just don't sit right with me, and I don't know that's that's just with me I I don't know what it is and it's it's certain ones mostly like Warframe is cool from what I play for it I kind of every time every now and then I go back to it but I don't but I don't play it that often. Cause every time and every time I take a good chunk of time off it, they add a whole bunch of new stuff to it, and I get lost. So, but again, Warframe <clears throat> on the Switch, you know they're gonna have to. Well, they're probably to get that to run on the Switch. It's probably doable. Would you actually want to play that? And I say this about a bunch of Switch games. Would you want that to play that on the tablet view, like out in the streets? Diablo 3? Me? No. Mario, certain, the Mario shit. Like, outside of, well, Odyssey, probably not. Uh, Breath of the Wild, probably not. Like, there are certain games that's like, none of the stuff's not going to run well. Although, I heard, I heard Breath of the Wild was, at the beginning, playing better in tablet mode than, than on the dock. But there are some of those games on the street, still on the Switch, and I'm like, there's no way in hell I'm playing, I would want to play that um outside of outside of on the TV that's just me that's just me um what am I doing here it's not your turn or something to time again I'm sitting here running my mouth and, and not so you're saying we can go outside and catch Pokemon but we can't go outside and play Warframe that what kind of justification on that I'm saying you could do what you want I'm just saying that I don't see how well it's going to play outside for for that stuff Again, Warframe might be the, the exception. There are probably more exceptions than I'm than I, than I'm um, giving credit to. And actually, hell, on the Pokemon front, they could have made it more like Go uh, to take it outside. But there's no like sensor or anything like that. So if they had put like a camera on it, hell, why don't we have a Pokemon Snap that we could take outside and do it like and 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 make it like a Pokemon Go? That would be fucking awesome. But that's just me. I don't work for Nintendo. <clears throat> and I'm not saying that's a, that's the justification. So I'm just saying that is a justification. And again, that is just me. Like other people will say it otherwise. You know, I don't know how Warframe is going to run. It might run great outside of, outside of the tablet. But that's just a game that's sort of like, you know. Would you play Destiny on the tablet outside? Let's say, because that's probably a closer comparison. Like, <laughs> uh, you know what, Raven? I wish I did work for Nintendo. I would, hell, I, at this point, right at this very second, I would love to work for Nintendo. Period, point blank. And if anybody's out there, um, um, for Nintendo. Well, you're whatever. Okay. Okay. See, you're just being a curmudge curmudgeon. That's all that is. Although Destiny on 2600 might be dope, though. You don't know. Um, all right. How about this? Uh, let's see. Because I'm thinking of a game you do play. How about The Division? 
Give me, give me a third person shooter give me, that you like. Red Dead Devin, the Red Dead Redemption. Well, no, no, not that Red Dead, because we already know how you feel about that one. But um, I know you don't like this, and you're just a hater. You're just a curmudgeonly hater. We love you though. Um, untap Frankie. I did tap. Uh, what are you doing? Thank you. I was trying to untap her. What are you doing? Okay, I mean, Warframe and Destiny are similar. Give, um, give me another game. <laughs> uh, congratulations, you have recorded. This, this is the longest tutorial I have ever taken. That is ridiculous. You know what? Here's what I'm going to do. I am going to... This is fucked up because I, I feel like I, I can... I probably should have played the tutorial, tutorial offline and kind of went in here, but... Oh, wait a minute. Yes, play this. Let's see what... You, what do you have to say, Charles Xavier? Um, I am the founder of this place, the Xavier Institute. A school for people like yourself. Man, I would say this dude is dead, but he's not dead anymore. <laughs> Otherwise, this would, have, this would have dated this game quite nicely. Probably still kind of does. Um... All right, how about that? Overwatch. Would you want to play Overwatch on the Switch? I feel like that's a dumb question in itself. I don't know why. Warframe is third. State of Decay is is third. Actually, State of Decay, weirdly enough, would pro... No. Graphics-wise, State of Decay would probably work on, on, the, on, the, on the tablet. Uh, no, let's not. I don't even know what he just said. Play this. Can you play? Well, shit. Hold on. Back. What just happened? I uh, remember training is okay. No, stop it. Select the path, hero. Oh shit! Branching path. Um, and that is my point. You would not want to play Overwatch on Switch. I mean, you probably would if. Well, the controls on the Switch are not that great, so I don't know if you would not you would really not want to do that anyway. Um, although the the um, the pro controls are good, not that good. Aim assist, yeah, maybe that's a yeah, that's a bad example. Um, I don't know, I can't think of one right now. It's late for me. So can we kill Xavier, please? So, to answer your Cyclops, will work. Uh -huh, that's funny. Paladins on Switch is meh. Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't even touch that. But then again, I don't like those type of games anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, the point is, like, Nintendo's good at Nintendo games. Nintendo's great at that stuff, obviously. And the whole nostalgia factor, all that and all that. All this other stuff they're shoveling and personal, like, it's good for the, some of the indie games, because some of the indie games do, do need a little bit, but they've been out there for, like, four or five years. You have nothing but space and opportunity to play that stuff. So put just pointing that stuff over to the Switch was not doing was doing no one the favors but Switch and and you know whatever because I'm just like I can't imagine that many people haven't that haven't played those games already. It's good for Nintendo. It's good for the for those developers. Don't get me wrong, but some of the stuff they're trying to put on there is like why? What's the point? <clears throat> um. For the sake of getting games on the Switch, which they've had a bad third, you know, Nintendo had a bad, very bad third party um, record in their last few consoles for, for stuff. Because it's either shovelware or it doesn't run great. Um, I'm going to go Hero. Why sure it's a whole, the world could use someone like you, but you have chosen a path fraught with danger where danger lurks around every age. So to... Um, Oh, that's a whole nother thing. Um, so, I mean, at this point, the only things that are online are Splatoon. I know that ARMS game, but I don't know who's still playing that. Diablo 3 is going to be uh, Mario Kart, obviously. So, to handle that stuff? Yes. Yes, it is. Um, the other stuff that you get with Nintendo Online, you might as well have bought one of the, the classics, the NES classics, 
Or they should have just put, which I wish they had done, was done the virtual console, but they would have had you paying for it again, which would have been stupid because there's no way in hell I'm playing for the, those games again. Actually, I probably did, and now that I think about it. Um, when you've already had it on previous consoles, previous Nintendo consoles, that that's, that is that is my whole thing. Um, so... And they still don't necessarily have online great, great. Like, yeah, game-wise is awesome, but you have to use your phone to matchmake with your friends in the console. Why? Why? So basically, you're, you're using... I mean, I don't, I don't know. It's Nintendo. Like I said, they still got ways of going at on that kind of stuff. No, I don't want to do this again. Get them off. Uh, actually, I don't know. I have really haven't really played enough of this to, sh to, to show this off, and yet. <laughs> uh, inhibited by worthless humans, while self-proclaimed heroes offer a meager defense against petty, small-minded villains. Uh, I don't know what else he just said. Still, is a planet not without whatever. With the proper adjustments, this could be a planet worth ruling. Wait, is this sinister? As a woman doing crime, and nobody appeared in use for the shadow, starting smile, dividing and conquering enemies and potential threats. That's sinister. That's got to be. And heaven help anyone who gets in my way. Why do you keep asking me? Okay. You can tell this is an old game because it keeps asking me that stuff. Um. Looks like another light night of web slinging with the amazing Spider-Man. Well, at least that's still a thing. Well, 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 what have we here? Half a dozen thugs and masks, the unmarked crates, da 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 da. I guess there's one way to find out what the look out. Wow, this is going by kind of fast. <laughs> okay. That could, that's totally could get annoying. Um, so it's Spider-Man versus Thieves start match. I got nothing. Standard rules. So you got a deck editor, you got a card store. I don't know. I haven't been through any of that. I may actually have to come back to this game. Um, you were randomly, so sure, I'll go first. Um, let's see. Oh, do I want to... Hmm, do I want to take a mulligan? Base of operations. Oh, look at that Avengers logo! Haha, <laughs> that's nice. Short lived, strong, and. I'm kill Baggy Man. Exhaust all characters he controls. Use the power only doing the attack step. I don't, don't want to do that. Um, Unexpected mutation. So, let's see. I can take a mulligan. You know what? All I got is Bishop, and I got this as a location, a plot choice. Uh, put the top card of your deck into your KO'd pile. That's your graveyard. Um, target spider friends, attacker. Uh, you could X plus and minus X. I don't want that. Where X is the cost of the card you put in your KO'd pile. Hmm. So let's take a mulligan. Let's get rid of this. Again, I have no freaking idea of what I'm doing here. I'm gonna get rid of this and this. Oh, shoot. Oh, so it's all or nothing. Oh, I can't do that. Huh, okay, well, that was probably a dumb mistake. Um, revealed resource step. Okay, so now I got more cards out of the deal. So let's see plot twist Marvel team up. Choose two different team affiliations among characters you control. Uh, ongoing characters you control, as well as cards in your hand, deck, and KO pile that have uh, either the chosen affiliations have both affiliations. Sure. 
Uh, attacking the tiger gets one plus two. This a turn. That's cool. Attacking the tiger gets three plus three. This attack while attacking is while attacking an exhausted defender. Well, Schmel, I may have fucked up. So that's uh, Punisher. Activate this card. The Spider Friends card, character card. <clears throat> Karo. Oh. So if I discard a Spider Friends character card, then I could knock out one of the opponent's stunned character. Uh, target character loses f flight and get minus one this turn. Okay, that's great if it's with somebody with flight. Hmm. Uh, and there was... Hmm. Recruits, so I don't know. I'm just gonna throw this out here because I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, passing stuff like, nope. Okay. So can I? So that's my uh, recruit a character or play an effect or pass. Hmm. No. 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 Didn't say anything about summon the sickness. So I feel like probably whatever I do now is gonna be fucked up. I probably need to just pass. Yeah, let's just do that. Formation step. Um hello. Hello, not a legal target. Alright, fine. I'm not showing this game off that great. This is awesome. Random punks come into play. All players lose one endurance. So this is your endurance here. Um, and I only have one resource, so I couldn't do much anyway right now. All right. Add an effect to the chain. So I guess I could do this one. Target character loses flight and gets one less attack this turn. Well, I could do that, except for the fact that he doesn't have flight. No, uh, these jokers don't have flight. And they probably can't attack now, anyway. Wait, he's got a plus two for attack, so. I'm gonna do it anyway, science. Um, pass. Trigger the effect, effect was resolved from the chain. Attack step. I can't attack because I don't have anything to attack with. So I fucked up. Yes, in the attack turn, because I didn't, I didn't have anything to put out there. However, he can attack me for one. Um. I mean, I can't, wait, what can I have done? Target attacker gets... Oh no, he's going to punch me. Been lurking and working this day, Dragon, bro. I'm sorry you days, Dragon, bro. That's kind of hard. I, you gotta hate it. Did you, um... Did you, did you, uh, take your Switch with you? Cause I know you've been known to do that on occasion. And hopefully the day will go by a lot faster cause I know this game is dragging. So you know what, I'm gonna take that L. Uh, let's see. And then activate target player exhaust a ready character he controls. That's great cause I don't have any ready characters so he can't do anything to me. Oh, wait. Mm. Oh, ooh, that's going to be fucked up, actually. Passing will forfeit your chance to play a resource. Okay, well, you know what? Let's do this. Uh, let's see. I don't know if I have any resources. Uh, 
Let's see, plot to us, uh, target spider friend's defender gets plus three. Hmm. Let's see, da 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 da, one two punch. I don't want to do that. See, the problem is, I only have one resource. I got no, and the only one I got out here is Punisher, and he takes four, so I can't put him out there. Um, I got Psylocke here, but again, I don't have enough resources. But we're gonna put her out there, any who's. Uh, choose two different team affiliations or clones. I don't know what this does. Wait, a minute. hold on, back up. Hmm. Characters you control, as well as cards in your hand. Duck, duck, duck. We'll have the chosen. Uh, choose two different team affiliations among the character you control. No valid choices. Of course. So, that was a dumb move. That was a dumb move. But I don't know if you caught any of the conversation uh, that we had. We're talking about the Game Awards, and we're talking about your your favorite console, the Switch. <laughs> uh, dip, <coughs> if you're still around. So... I'm, I would be surprised if you had any, any thoughts on either one of those subjects. Uh, let's see. Although, given what time it is and how I'm really, really fucking this up, I might end up shortly closing down the stream and coming back later with something different. Because I got a couple of games that I've been really, really waiting to play. Um, that I'm that uh, that I've been wanting to, and I might even may or may not even be stream one of them. I actually I probably will, because this is one of them I kind of want to just for the shits of it, regardless. Um, all right, past that, my in recruits that. Well, I can't do anything because I don't have any freaking resources. Oh wait, I do have two resources. See, resource set, yeah, so there ain't shit I can do. Target, da, da, da. so pass, stop, continue. Oh my gosh, I'm freeing this up. This is what happens when you skip tutorials, folks. This is what happens. You think you know the card game, but the card game thing does you better. And this is shit, old shit anyway, I ain't never played. Um. Okay, so let's see what we got going on here. So I can't do a smacking thing because I don't have any resources to put on. I don't have any enough resources to put these jokers out on the board. Um, and then, so I'm a pass. I can't move characters because and he's going to attack me again with these freaking random punks that I can't do snap about. Yep. Oh wait. Uh, target attacker does. Yeah, why would I want to give him more? It's more. Why would I want to do that? Are you silly? All right. So yes, I just lost two and more endurance. Um. Oh wait, how is he attacking? Wait, how is he attacking? He has no, um, he has zero for attack. What are you supposed to be, what do you think you're doing? All right, well, let's we'll see what you're gonna do. Uh, passing down my ender stat frame, I can't do anything else, so that's fine. Um, uh, Wait, hold on. How did I lose two? Oh, right, because of this dude. I was about to say, wait, what the f... Because this dude has no attack, so there's no way he could do anything. Um, okay. Resource step. If I had a location, I could get some resources. I don't have that, and I don't think I can use these plot twist for such things. Um, defender gets plus three. Let's do that. No, nope, that's that was. 
Oh wait. Um, choose one. Okay, your target equipment or replace face down. Target character loses flight and gain gets one uh, minus one attack. Yeah, see. So I could do this, put that on him, but it ain't gonna do me no good. All right, well. Uh, choose the one KO equipment, KO target equipment, and then none of these have an equipment on them, so fizzle mazizzles. Hmm, not showing this game off very well. I admit that. But, let's see, let me see if I can get through a just your formation or pass. I have no formation, so pass. Let's see, resource though, what does he have anyway? So, okay, whenever a defender you control becomes powered up, it has reinforcement, this attack, exhaust two spider friends, characters. Alright. Does this count as equipment? Because, no, man, no, I don't. Alright, let it roll. This is what I get for for um for not going through the, the tutorials ahead of time. But I've kinda sorta got the gist as I just can't do with anything with the cards I got. Uh wait, plus yeah, there there ain't shit I could do. So honestly I kinda fucked myself on this one. Let's be brutally honest. Uh, what it is whenever arcade stuns a character, KO that character. Whenever arcade becomes stunned, KO him. Oh, great. Uh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. So, actually, after I do this next couple of times, I think I'm going to call it because. That's it. I'm not really showing this all too well. Although I'm getting a gist of it, I just can't do anything, and this is kind of fucked up to watch. It all told, uh, let's see. Uh, hey, I got a Spidey card I can't do shit with. Great. Choose one, kill target, uh, replace face down, resource your control, or gain two endurance. Choose one. Oh, wait, so that means I could. No, I can't do that, can I? Gain two. Oh, wait. Hmm. I can do that. Gain two endurance back. Um, fifth down resource. I don't have any resources, and that is the problem. And I can't put not a goddamn card out because I don't have any. Um, wait. Oh wait, do I have any? Yeah, I do. Hang on, I got... Mm -hmm. I got four resources, so I should be able to put them out. Activate this card. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Yep, pass. Formation. Hmm. Yep. I'm wrapping this up because I'm fucking this up left and right. Because uh, I can't do shit. And this is not showing well. Although I might come back to this as soon as I do. If I get some more under my belt. I should have played a little bit before I got in here. But I figured it wasn't going to be that hard to do. Um, and I should have finished going through the tutorials. But I figured that wouldn't have been that much more exciting as either way. Like, I kind of get, I know the basic gist of it, but I can't do anything with what I got. Or, I fucked up doing it with what I got, because probably should have kept the other hand. Because I had something to start off with. Actually, wait, can I? Uh, no. 
How do I stop this crazy thing? I can't attack because I have nothing to attack. Yeah, because I can't put anything out on the board. Right, he's tapped, he's tapped. And I'm just getting lit up. And wait, what is this? Um. Oh. Attack stuff so Yeah, I don't. I don't get that part either. But like, why would you tap those? You didn't need to. Hey, Nubian. How goes, ma'am? Passing now. My end of text. That's fine. I can attack. Um, I am going to shout out this lady in the chat at this point in time because she's one catching me at the end of this was seemingly going to be the end of the stream for now until later on and two she streams on Mixer either way when she streams which is not that often but when she does it's awesome um and that is B-U-T-I if I'm not mistaken on that you can go check out on Mixer.com slash Nubian Beauty She's a good person. Sometimes she gets on me and makes me feel sad, but no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Kidding. I'm okay to you. <laughs> oh, you're welcome, dear. But um should have been here earlier. We were talking about the the game awards and switch and stuff like that, which I know you didn't get a chance to see, so. Um Ooh, equipment. So let's see, resource phase. Put that out there. Equipped character gets plus two attack plus has fight. That's great. Um, you fell back to sleep. Well, you, you needed it after. I mean, to be fair, you needed it. So I'm not fault you for it. In fact, I'm probably going to fall asleep here before too long. So I'm kind of surprised I'm still up now. Because I was trying to play, um, I was trying to play that Anthem beta or, or alpha earlier, and that was a wash. And, um, I was going to mess with this earlier than that, which I probably should have done this then, than now. Um, but, why is it, why is it, why is it? What do you mean? Why, what, why? Why, what, why, why? <laughs> Uh, let's see, can I do anything? So I got five resources. Um, and I got characters I can put out. But what I don't have, let's see, one, two, two. wait, can I? Oh wait, hold on. What is the three? Oh, that's already done. I saw the Anthem thing, what was it about? Um, it is, I mean, it's the alpha for the game that's coming out next week by next week, next year, excuse me, by Bioware. It's kind of, they call it a loot shooter, so, it's, but it's kind of like Destiny and Mad, uh, Destiny mixed with Mass Effect, kind of, but I don't know, because I didn't get a chance to play. I, I couldn't get onto the server, and they did say that, hey, if the server's going to be busy, then keep trying, but... And um, the funny thing was that people were trying to stream it and got banned. So they got so they got their origin accounts. Um, so people who were streaming it got all their games taken out of um, got got taken from Origin. I'm not gonna lie. If if I had seen something that said you could stream it, that I would have done it, but I didn't. Yeah. So it served them right. Although, well. All I can say is that it has a nice menus. I did take, I did record a little bit of that, which you know, you, then I, I'm not gonna put out. <clears throat> but yeah, it was kind of, it was kind of ridiculous. I think people are probably still trying, but I don't know. That's, hey, they didn't say anything about letting it be. It, it, one is an alpha. If they had said, you, hey, go ahead and stream it. I one I doubt if it would have been an alpha because they don't normally let alpha stuff 
get you know get streamed if they know what's good for them because it's still in a rough rough spot so yeah it is what it is and I'll try again tomorrow tomorrow morning because I know I was um, I was supposed to get in the slot for this morning. Well, I got in the slot for this morning and I got in and downloaded the beta and everything and I got in. I just couldn't get on the server. So hopefully I'll try again tomorrow morning during the next time they let me. Because I think it's one. Like I think it ends in a little bit anyway. Because they only had like three hour sections, three hour blocks to let people play. And the next block is um, I'll be asleep by the time the next block comes uh, this afternoon, which would be like three o'clock. And I was scheduled for the, the morning block anyway, because that was the only time I could get, you know, that was the best time for me. All right, uh, recruit, stop that. Formation. Hmm. Yep, all right, you know what's about to happen? I'm about to call it because I am not playing and I don't even know how to get out of this fucking game. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Before I do that, let me try something here. You were a random selected. Uh, yes. Mm, no, let's not take a moment. We're going to see what happens. Should have done this like five minutes ago. And actually, this was a dumb move because da, 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 I got no resources. Well, dandy. Hmm. I thought I do like these cards. Gives me time to see what I missed. Well, I can safely say that... There we go. Wait, what just happened? Um... Okay, well then why wouldn't you let me do... Okay. Okay, so the parlor's out there. Got it. Give them... Um... Not, it's, um, yes and no. Like, it's more, it, it's seemingly more magic. Although, I mean, you could say that Hearthstone is kind of like, it's basically a stripped down version of magic. So this is kind of a cross between, um, this is actually probably kind of like Hearthstone, but more like magic. If, if that makes any sense. And if you've never played Magic, that probably doesn't make any sense. Because there's more... It looks like this is a little bit more resource intensive. Or resource uh, management like Magic is than Hearthstone is. However, by the way, Nubian, dear, lady, lady. If you happen to have Hearthstone on you real quick. Would you want to um, play me in it? Cause I need to. I got a. I got a quest. I want to try to deal with. I mean, if you don't, that's fine. But no, like I said, this is this is probably more like like straight up magic, and then and this is this game has been around for a while. Although I don't know too many people that's playing it now, and this was just like a, a digital version of the actual physical game that came out years ago and i like i said i just bought i just got this you don't have the game installed that's fine that's fine um it's no worries like i said i just saw the the i just saw the quest out there and i was like let me see if i can pull somebody in so i can so i can do this but tis no 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 don't don't do it you don't have to do it don't worry I mean, unless you want those six free, the six packs that they're supposedly giving out, uh, which I told D about. It. I don't know if he got them or not, but but nah, you don't have to reinstall it. Like I said, it's not a big deal. Um, I just I just like going in there tooling tooling around with it and and I just happen to see that quest. Um, so let's see, past recruit stuff. I think I'm done here. 
Because, yes, I did that. Um, and I guess I'm ready to recruit it. I'm actually already a, a step ahead. Let's see, what is it? Um, whenever product causes a breakthrough, draw a card, then discard it. I'm not going to do that shit. Um, I don't need to boom him because he's right where I want him. So, I don't mind. Well, I mean that's on you if you if you if you want to, but that you really don't have to do it on my account. Like I said, um, let's see, recruit stuff. I don't have anyone else I need to recruit. I don't have any resources to recruit. So basically, just this one is is like kind of more like magic. It's like you get resources. And your resource, well, I mean Hearthstone too, but at least, you, but you get resources every. Um, you get in in Hearthstone, you at least get resources like once every, you know, every turn. In this one, you have to have a, a certain. You have to have research. You have to have to have the resources to get what you need to be able to uh, play the cards. And you don't get that every step, like um, like you do in Hearthstone. Like I said, that's why I say it's more like magic, because at least in magic, you get a resource. You have the potential to get a resource every turn that you can use to play cards, but you might not ever get it. So in magic, it's called lands. You, if you have enough lands you, and you have enough, you play enough lands, you can put out your cards. In this case, I only have one resource and I, and I put him out already because each card. So each card has a cost, which is right here at the top top right so i need seven resources to be able to be able to, to put this person on the board and i don't have that i only have one and i already put somebody out on the board and there's an attack and just like hearthstone and magic you know you have your attack which is this top number here and your defense which is this number here and you can fight with the person with um with folks so like in this case uh trigger the random effects and you have effects and stuff like that so let's see, with random punks comes into play, all players lose one endurance, which means I'm fucked because, oh wait, actually this is your endurance here, which is basically your life points. So if he triggers this, uh, then both of us are going to lose a resource, which, you know, hey, that's fine. You can lose some too. Um, triggered random specs. So we both got 49. So now it's time for the attack stage. Um, so if I hit attack him, so I've got one attack here and one defense. He's got two attack and one defense. I can easily kill him. Oh, I can, I can, I can take this, this dude, these dudes off the board. It would behoove me, may behoove me to do that or not. Um, select defender, which I'm going to go ahead and do, because why not? Um, add an effect to the chain. I don't have any. So I'm just going to go ahead and attack him. That should take him off the board, but it's also going to take my dude off the board because we both have one defense. So my attack hits his defense. And if my effect, uh, attack is the same as his defense or greater than his defense, he's gone. Yeah, basically, YOLO. All right, keep going. Come on. Look up. So, yep. Idea. Which is what I should have done earlier. I should have restarted this earlier and done this. Which he hits me for two, but it's fine because he ain't attacking my life points. Well, actually, he did attack my life points. How did he do this? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Was there. Son of a biscuit. Okay, so here's the thing. I just noticed this. So I still lost life point, and so did he. Which, depending on what game you're playing, doesn't normally happen unless um, you have uh, unless there's a unless something would that will trigger it weird but apparently 
he still because what normally would happen like say in a game of Hearthstone, Hearthstone or even Magic, you know, these two cards battle out. My one hits his one uh defense. They get taken we both get taken off the board. He hits my man, but he hits my card and not my life points. In this c- case, that doesn't appear to have happened. Um so that's weird. Um, and I have nothing else to attack with, so that ends that step. Oh, freaking well. Which actually should have taken them to the graveyard, which... But it didn't. Hmm. Again, looking at the tutorial would have helped me a great deal, which I did earlier in the stream, but I didn't finish the whole thing, so... Once again, my flipping fault. Um, armored spider suit costs one less to recruit for each spider friend's character. And then there's a whole, there's a whole bunch of stuff other going on. Like there's locations, there's uh, team affiliations because it's Marvel and whatever. And, and they have like different, uh, things to go along with it. Target character lose flights and get one minus one attack this turn. So what I probably might want to do. So I could take this joker and like blap. Which means that now he's got one he's got one attack and one defense. I got one attack and one defense. We are absolutely even. What should have happened though, both of our cards should have gone to the graveyard. I don't know what happened. Again, if I had if I had looked at it more, uh looked at the tutorial more, I probably would have known. Because I have never played this game before now. I think I've said that more than once a time. Um I can't recruit because I don't have any resources to recruit anything. But what I can do, uh, let's see, he's three, four, I can't really do anything. I mean, it's telling me that, hey, I can put some cards, but all I can do, if I click on any of these cards, it's going to put them right here, and I won't be able to do anything with them because I don't have any resources to actually put them on the board. Like, I need to put some jokers there. Um, although, wait, let's see this. He's three. It becomes thunder an attack. You may return the character to his own to... Wait, if a character you control would become stunned during the during an attack team, the team attack, you may return that... So I might want to put him out there when I can. Uh, and I will end my... Uh, Alright, so now I'm going to try this again. Wait, formation. So now I'm in the formation step, which... Again, this is why this is more like magic, because there's more steps at least in hearthstone it's like hey you put the card out there if you can attack you can attack if you can't attack then then you won't like you know most cards will have like a summon season which means they can't they can't do they can't attack on the turn that you bring them out on which this seems to not do um interestingly enough I'm going to try to kick butt, but I don't see, I don't know how this is going to work. Because once again, this is doing some things that, that I was not expecting. Okay. Oh, wait. That was, that was dumb because I didn't need to move the card. All right. Now then, attack. And it's his turn, so he's gonna attack me, which fine. Let go. So he's attacking me, which again, he's got one attack. Wait a minute. What the hell did he get three attack from? Um Oh shit, okay. So he got this equipment card, which gave him plus two to his attack. And now I'm gonna be fucked up. So the thing I just did on him, um, it ain't gonna work because he just powered the fuck up. 
So that's awesome. Oh well, so which means that he's gonna knock my card out. And I ain't gonna do shit to his card. Um, which means that oh, okay. So my card took one took the, took one hit, and the rest went to my resources, as you just saw. So apparently, this, this, the, so apparently this this game's got trample just built in. That's weird. Trample means that any damage that your card doesn't goes that goes over your card goes to you. So that's interesting. Um, and I don't have any attackers, so this is still going bad for me. And again, this is your life points, or AKA your endurance. So once that gets to zero, this, this is gone. And see each of your opponents who control, wait, each of your opponents who controls more stun characters than you Puts the top five cards of his deck into his cape, your old power. Well, I don't, I mean, I don't have, I can't do nothing about that, so. Recovery phase. Hang about. What did you just do? Oh, okay, so because my character, so because he knocked my card out and used this, then that means that the top five cards on my deck just got thrown into the trash. So, yay, that's not good at all. And here we go again. Uh, and again, I got nothing. Like, if I had some Reese, oh wait, here we go. Um. Wait, can I actually? I see, I can't do that. That was nice. Again, if I had resources, yeah, it is. And there's and there's still something about this that um, I'm missing here. So again, I'm not showing this game all that great because of that. So I got re three resources right now, but. Uh, something says I think I fucked up. <clears throat> so I got three resources, and I could, if I, if, if it would let me, I could put this, put this card on the field, but I can't. Uh. And again, I don't have enough resources to do anything with these cards, otherwise I could put these out. So, that's fucked. Uh, Alright, formation. I can't, I'm not gonna change the formation, I only got one card, it doesn't really matter. Um, so, there's no point in doing that. So he's just gonna continue to continue to just beat down, whoop down on my on my dude, cause this is the only dude on that, and he's and he's got a oh weight, and he just gained another. Hold on, does he? Oh shoot! Hang on, how did he gain? Wait, let's see. Um, he equipped character gain two plus two and has reinforcement. Hmm. Well, this is a bunch of bullshit, Alaldo. Oh, that's right, because the thing I did to him last turn is gone, so therefore he got his point back. And now he just put another dude out on the board. Whereas I can't do a smacking thing. So I'm in no better shape than I was in. Oh wait, now he's got another one. So, again, if you have enough resources, you can put enough characters out, I mean, cards out on the board. I don't have, like, this is not my resources. So here's his resources here, this one. So if he had another one cost card, he could put another card on the board, which he just did, because he had three. 
Um, and now he's moving his cards around. Because I think I can only attack his front cards or whichever. Yeah. This is... This is not going well. There's no point in me attacking. Because, like, the only thing I can do in this case is attack one of his cards in the back. And I don't know if it's going to let me do that. Yeah, it is. But there's no point in doing that because... I don't have any effect cards. So, I can attack him. And that'll stun him. Yep, so he's gonna knock my card out and I'm gonna knock his out. But this card and this card will still be able to, to attack, which means let's see this four six. So I'm gonna catch six damage to the to the to the net. I know. So there he goes with that. Yep. And he's going to attack again with this job for two more. There has to be a way to auto. Hold on a second. Mm. Options. Um. Facebook in auto order. I don't know what auto order is. Well, I guess I would. Um, let's see. Recover phase. So now we're back uh, to resource stuff again. <gasps> oh God, I'm I am in a bad way. See, I don't have any resources. All I got is character cards. So, what is this doing for me? Nada. In fact, I think I might be fucking up by putting these, by putting these cards there, but I'm, I'm not sure. Because what I should be doing is putting cards like, um, like location cards to get me more resources, but I don't have anything. All I have are character cards. So. <laughs> That's fine. I'm about. To, um, I'm probably gonna give this up in a little bit, though. So. Um, can't do that. So take your time. This sucks a donkey is. Although I weirdly still want to see an updated version of this game. I'll, mm, my inability to. To. Um, actually, I'm about to lose this anyway. The music just took a drastic change. That's. <laughs> Damn, do y'all hear that? That music just did a swift change. Alright, recovery. Alright, here we go. Uh, put the top card of your deck into your K-Reward pile. Target Spider Friends Attacker. Uh, you control gets X plus X. Or X is the cost of the card. You put into your K-Reward card. Put it this way. Hey, Shucky! Mm. Okay. I, 
Okay. So we're kind of, sort of, kind of getting somewhere? Oh, wait a minute. When is this? Two, five, seven. So for each card you put in this spot, you get a resource. What it seemed like. But why wasn't it let me do this? Do something with them earlier? That part doesn't make any sense. Again, tutorial. Reading is fundamental. Um, but in this way, at the start of the phase, uh, She-Hulk gets plus one attack this turn for each front row character target. So, in other words, she should get... So she could, she could, so she's supposed to be getting plus one for this one dude. Um, let's test that theory out, shall we? I don't want to move characters. <clears throat> now that I think about it, this is, um, I think Elder Scrolls Legend has this, like, whole front row, back row thing also. There's another card game, the digital card game that is out there has that, the whole front row, back row thing. And granted, there are other card games that do also, but, um, okay. So, that did work. So, there's two here, and, all right, well, that worked out, sort of. Um, so now the question is, who the hell am I going to attack? Is it going to attack him or attack her? Man. I get... Psh. All right, yeah, do it. So, 7-7, seven seven, which means she's still good on defense. So, she's not exhausted. She's just been... Well, she's exhausted. And these stunned. Because they... So, when they flip the card around like that, that means they're stunned. Uh, and there's not really much I can do outside of this, except for that. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. But my dude is stunned. Okay. And I can't attack again because cause she's been tapped. Uh, recovery phase. I mean, I'm about to lose this anyway, so might as well go for the gusto. All right, here we go. Base of operations. I got a location card. Activate. Look at the top of your card. Uh, you may put that card on the bottom of your deck. So this is going there. Um, so I got six. So recruit step, which means I should be able to... Let's see. Let's, let's, uh, let's recruit... Nova, put him out on deck. Okay, I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. It took freaking long enough. Um, look at the top of your card. You may put the card on the bottom of your deck. I don't see why I would do that. Uh, formation, no, we're just going to leave that right there. Uh, activates, target player exhausts a ready character he controls. Oh no. Ah, fudge sickle. Okay. So he just used this card. He activated this card, which went ahead and tapped my, my big dude here, which means that he can't attack this turn. And now he's about to take out, and now she's about to take out him, which I wish I could block 
there was no way I could have blocked with with uh, She Hulk. I don't think so. He's gonna get exhausted. I mean, he's gonna get stunned rather. Excuse me. And the rest of it's gonna come out of my life points. So that's absolutely smashing. So let's see. Uh, four four. Whenever arcade stuns a character KO, so no, I don't want to do that. Um, honestly, I should try to take this out of the game, but that's waste. So I'm going to attack them for what good is it? Because I'm about to lose this anyway, and probably once I lose this game, I'm going to end this. It's inevitable. Um, yep. Yeah. She's good. She's just gonna be exhausted. That's fine. But he's gonna be stunned. Which is weird. There's no way to take I thought Again, I thought in the realm of like say magic or hearthstone that these were gonna go off the board. And apparently that does not happen. So that's that's um that's kinda interesting. But at least all right. Oh, Jen got more because there's more people out in the front, on the front here. Okay. So she's got more, gets more attack, the more people. I like that card. Hell, if I built a deck with this, with her, she's going to be front and center. I can't attack anymore. So, recovery. Again, I'm going to lose this. I already know that already, but it's all good. Um, let's see. Target attacker gets 1-1. One, one. Um, activates target exhausts all characters he controls, use of power. Hmm. But, so if I put him over here, I can't use him. So, because it doesn't seem like I can use any cards outside of resources. So, I'm going to put that card there. And let's see, since I got seven, I can recruit a Joker. Um, human Torch, when Human Torch attacks, you may pay three Endurance. Well, I wanna do that, I'm about to lose anyway. Uh, Crystal, who's the support worker to the front row, use this only during the combat phase. And I don't know how useful that's gonna do me. So let's recruit. Actual KO card due to uniqueness skill. No. Wait, what? What happened? The Hornet. Exhaust spider friend characters you control. Target one. Target player loses one. Um, hang about a second. Why am I KOing anything? I don't think that was what I wanted to do. I feel kind of sort of curtained. KO battering around, target exerts, so it's like, I don't. I feel like I did something fucked up. Actual. The uniqueness rule. I don't get what's going on there, so I must have fucked something up. Because I don't want to activate. I'm not trying to activate, I'm trying to recruit. There we go. Let me recruit that, that's weird. Um, there we go. It wouldn't click, that's weird. All right, uh, yakada yakada. So I'm done with that. Cause I'm starting to get the hang of this kinda. I'm just gonna let that go. But I really am going to go back and play the tutorial uh, properly, and then maybe I'll try to stream this again. Even though I don't think I appreciate anyone who came by here to check this out. Um, 
Because card games and me, not a very good, uh, you know, uh, show. But I try. I definitely try. Wait, what are you doing? Um, oh, so I gotta exhaust one of these jokers. Uh, hmm. You take the fall. Um, at the start of the turn, she gives, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to attack with Jin. Um, da, 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 da. Let's do this. Yes. Attack with him. That would be some fun shit if I actually came back and won this. I know it's not going to happen. But at least I'm kind of sort of starting to get the hang of this. It's kind of what happens when you're Bruce Force shit. Um, and then with this, actually let's do, let's see. I wonder if I can it's not eight. So yeah, let's attack with that. Yeah, I'll do that. Oh man, this is this is actually starting to turn around. This is. Freak your tickets. Whenever no attack, you may discard a spider friend's character card. If you do, uh, where X is the cost of the card, do you, do you discard? No, I don't want to do that just yet. I get it. But I don't want to. So, she gets stunned. And whatever less comes out of their, their life points, which means they get three taken off the rip. I might actually win this. Oh, shit. Yo, I might actually, no, well, actually, I probably won't win this. Oh, wait, uh, let's see. So that's nine, that's four. Let's see, that's eight, that's 12, that's 14, that's 15, that's 16, that's 17, that's He's got nine. He's only got two. So that'll be seven, which should take down from his life points. Uh, do I want to? Then add two with that card. Just to be on the safe side. Let's see if this science is going to work out to my benefit or not. Actually, I should have put that on Jen. That was dumb. So, it's minus 10. Which means he should eat... Okay. That worked out just exactly how I wanted it. So, which means I should be... I should, I should win. Because he's got negative 3. And there is no reason for me to attack. Because... You know what? Screw I've already won, I think. Yes, holy shit. I actually won that. <laughs> I actually fucking won that. Wow. <laughs> I, am, I am simply stunned. And on that note, I am actually going to end this stream because that's probably kind of painful for anybody to watch. Uh, but I did get, I got a multiplayer avatar, which um, this, this game is powered by GameSpy. GameSpy is no longer around. And I'm pretty sure there's no way to just, to, to, to patch in multiplayer. Um, so yeah, but I got some points, whatever that goes for, and a new mission unlocked. So great. That's awesome. Um, folks, this has been, I can't believe I won that. I, I, I'm stunned. I'm absolutely stunned. Anyway. Um, I won. Yay, me. My, this has been Marvel Trading Card Game. This was done by Konami back in 2006, 7, something like that. It was on the PC. They, it was on the, the, the 3DS. You can probably still find the game. 
out there if you are so interested in this, or you could, you know, um, whisper me. I might be able to hook you up. Um, regardless, uh, I have been Roddy Cat. This has been whatever the stream has been, and I appreciate each and every one of you for coming by. I may stream something later because there's a couple of games um, I want to been I've been dying to get to, but I've been sick. So, at the very least, I'm going to do that. By, by golly, by Jove. So, for everybody who's come out, peace out. And I will check you all out later. Peace.